Unveiling the meaning, pull up the anchor. Hello, everyone, welcome back to our channel, where we dive into the fascinating world of English language learning. Today, we're exploring a very interesting phrase, pull up the anchor. Whether you're a beginner or advanced learner, understanding these idiomatic expressions can truly elevate your English skills. So, let's set sail on this linguistic journey and discover what lies beneath the surface of this expression. The phrase, pull up the anchor, originates from a very literal action associated with boats or ships. An anchor is a heavy object that is dropped into the water to prevent the ship from moving. When it's time to set sail or move the ship, the anchor must be lifted or pulled up from the bottom of the sea. This action signifies the beginning of a journey or the departure from a current location. Beyond its literal use, pull up the anchor is often employed figuratively in everyday English. In a metaphorical sense, it means to prepare to leave or to start something new. It's about letting go of what holds you back and moving forward. This can apply to various contexts, such as leaving a job, moving to a new city, or starting a new chapter in life. To better understand how to use this phrase, let's look at some examples. After five years at the same job, I've decided it's time to pull up the anchor and explore new opportunities. They finally pulled up the anchor and moved to Spain, something they've always dreamed of. We need to pull up the anchor on this project and get moving, time is running out. These examples show how versatile the expression can be, fitting into professional, personal, and project-related contexts. I hope this exploration of pull up the anchor has been enlightening and adds a valuable expression to your English vocabulary. Remember, language learning is a journey full of discoveries, and each new phrase or idiom is a step forward in understanding the rich tapestry of the English language. Thank you for joining me today, and I look forward to our next linguistic adventure. Happy learning, and don't forget to pull up your own anchors and explore the endless possibilities of the English language.